Good morning. Welcome to another episode of Mr. Miller's Classroom. I'm a STEM guy. Good to have you aboard today. And I uh, thought I'd just give you an update on uh, one of the classroom experiments that we were working on. This was uh, at least part of the board that we had going on in the classroom. We were doing the, the famous uh, take the white bread, put the handprint on the bread, isolate it inside the plastic baggie, and see what nasty things grow. We have a uh, uh, a pretty much a, a classic application of the experiment here. We have uh, we have our control. Uh, this was the piece of bread that, and, and all of these we uh, our students handled with um, with uh, latex or uh, plastic rubber gloves, and um, tried not to get any germs on them. Took them straight out of the bag, put it or out of the wonder bag, put it straight in the plastic, double bagged it, dated it, labeled it didn't touch it, didn't breathe on it. And uh, so the control grew absolutely nothing. Uh, but, uh, well, we've got a couple of interesting things to show you today. So here's one right here. I'll just kind of push it up towards the camera here. And you can see uh, what grew there on that piece of bread. Um, take a guess. What, uh, what do you think? I have written on here. I'm looking at the back of it. Now, what do you think uh, that was? I'll reveal that in a second. Um, Choices might be, uh, we took the piece of bread, they put the gloves on, uh, and they touched it to a doorknob, perhaps, uh, or they put a handprint on it. So take a guess at that one. Um, this one, I'm going to kind of unclip it here. This one fascinates me. It looks like two eyes. I'll hold it up there for you to see it. You see it right there. And then um, on the back, look at that right there. All right, take a guess and think what, what you think, you know, where, where they contacted that piece of white bread. And then the last one I'll show you today is this one right here, kind of nasty. Look at this, this upper corner is kind of strange. What's going on there? Okay, so let's uh, do the reveal. Of course, remember we have the control here. There's nothing growing on that. You can literally take a piece of white bread, and put it in a plastic bag, put it out on a counter, It'll, it'll just sit there. Um, recently, there was a video that kind of uh, was going around the internet, um, and it showed uh, this gentleman. And now, this video is old. It's from like 2012 or 13, I think. And uh, he had a loaf of white bread. I think it was Wonder Bread. He'd kept it for 11 years, opened it up, took a piece out, took a bite of it. I wouldn't recommend doing that. Um, but it was just completely dehydrated, just like an old stale cracker. Nasty looking. Okay, so here was the first one we looked at. Here's the white bread, and uh, so what do you think? What's your guess? Okay, this is um, um, the scientists, students in my class, took the white bread, gloves on, and they rubbed it across a Chromebook, just one Chromebook, and uh, that's what grew. Notice, check this out. Look at how the rings, it looks like they're rings of growth. And also, you see the similarity here. That's a totally different uh, bacteria growing there. Uh, but it should remind you of this one here. That's interesting. Check it out. Another close-up side-by-side. So what do you think this one was? Two little black dots right there. Okay, students, and they gloved up, and they pressed the the white bread against the smart board and that's what they picked up off the smart board took a few weeks to grow very interesting and let's see finally this one this one for this was a weird one this you usually expect a little bit of this but this was after our student um that we chose randomly actually washed their hands just hand sanitizer only that's all they use is hand sanitizer have a feeling that uh, maybe they put the heel of the hand here. It wasn't all over the bread. It is front and back, a little bit on the back. Um, there's some gross stuff going on there, but it caused some really strange things to happen on that bread um, or that piece of bread. So um, that was hand sanitizer only. I think their hand was, was dried with a paper towel. So I'm not really sure what's going on with that one. So uh, interesting experiment. Um, you can view uh, examples of this uh, online on YouTube. It's a really interesting, really cool experiment. And so I hope you enjoyed that today. Thanks for joining us for another episode of
Mr. Miller's classroom.